Well folks, I join you today outside of uh, our lodge here. We've got the uh, enclosed trailer and we've got our new ice shack standing over there. It's, uh, it's a hard shack, homemade shack. We got it from a guy uh, over in uh, Minnesota. We're actually taking it out for the first time today and we're gonna see if we can't catch a fish in it too. It's just a simple wheelhouse. You drop it when you get down there lowers to the ground and uh, we can go into more specifics later but as of now we're gonna hook this up hey Carter would you look in the back of the pickup and see if we've got some got enough minnows for the day why sure let me just look at the minnows that have been in the back of the pickup out in the elements all day looks like a solid block of ice to me Clark and we got about two tree four of them yeah this just Top tier. Top tier. You can't make this one up, folks. And therefore, we have to go spend another four dollars a scoop. Yeah, they froze. What so, did? The minnows. Oh. You well, had them outside. It was only. How bad? The whole thing. It's a solid block. Oh, we'll, we'll just get some fresh. With some minnows sprinkled in there like salt and pepper. Caden! Caden! His pickup just started. The camera just started getting inverted in there. So if you turn the wheel one way, it goes the. It's the opposite of what you would think. Yeah, look look at him do it again. What are you doing? Oh! Not even close. That's exactly what's going on right now, folks. He's dealing with the inverted camera. He's gonna figure that out right about now after about three tries. Wow. Wow, folks. Right on that. Whoa! What are you what are you aiming towards here? My camera is a very it's inverted too. Yeah, it is. I know. I see you do that. Come on, it's just a straight line. I never knew it was like that. It it just started doing that. It's just gonna be the opposite of what you usually think. Hold this pin here. Set them all in one spot. All right, hold up, buddy. Pull your first pin, but not the second one. Now pull the pin, kid. Too much. Yeah, that collar's supposed to go in between, the pin. Right here? Uh, yeah. Nice and slowly. Keep her going. Keep weight on it. Okay, you've, tu you've touched on the back, and now you gotta lower the rest of the jack. That's good there. Slide up and then lower it. Not. That's me jigging up right down there, and then I can see fish on both sides of me. I'm running the Royal Flush by Frostbite, 34 inch, paired with a uh, 13 inline reel. Might have to do some bouncing around later as well. Coming back, coming back. You missed him? Yeah. You stinking pig. Here, watch. 
That's it. I guess I can't feel anything. Got him? I do it small. No. Nope. Oh my gosh. Nice. Wow. First fish in the new shack. All right. That's Although it is 15 inches, so we're not gonna eat this one today. Down to the depths. I, uh, I'm not too far from shore at all, but I'm in 33 foot, and it just dumps right down. I can see it on the graph pretty clearly. A lot of deep water out here. What's going on over there? Huh? That one's gonna need to get covered up, hey? Mm. We ain't letting that freeze outside, dude. That's gonna burst the pipes. What are we, how'd that one go? Oh, man. That's usually something I'd wait to go back to the bathroom to. Usually that's not something that I'm gonna do out here. But we just got out here. It kind of got to the point where we weren't really gonna be able to make it too much longer, so we kind of had to do what we had to do. And yeah, I don't know. Like I said, that's usually not something we like to fool around with out here, but. <laughs> Today we didn't really have a choice. All in all, it was all right. It was all right. Fishing free bed, Paul. Yep. That's how we do. Gina. Oh, he's back. Do you know what? Got one. What's do? Dude. Um, so we're back here. This will be our second day. We're actually gonna stay the night in the shack tonight. We're gonna go out there. We're gonna move it right away to some deeper water. And we're going to get it set up for the for the big game later on tonight. So. Well, as soon as you start thinking of yourself as playing a role, because the truth is, happened to civilization. It's happened all over the place. I think it's happened in music. I think that it's happened in art. I think that it's happened pretty much everywhere. What's this bowl for? Is this a rabbit reel? No. Decent? Yeah, not bad. You have a four wheel? Oh, yeah. yeah. We only do it in. All right, well, this is home. This is home. Now we just got to redo everything that we did earlier. Getting some football broadcasted. Just getting some stuff set up and uh, we can't set up the shack in a new location without uh, numb nuts, without numb nuts uh, uh, messing the ice. Absolutely ruining the ice. And uh, Chris, I believe you're down there with Caden Lens right now and uh, gonna get some inside information. Hi, yeah, uh, James, here I am with Kate, and uh, walk, walk me through what, what exactly was going on through your mind b before and, and uh, during the uh, business. Well, yet again, another one I usually wouldn't do on the ice. Uh, wow, that's actually one I probably wouldn't even do at home. I had, I'd probably go somewhere that has a bidet. <laughs> and it's pathetic, it really is. We just got out onto the ice. Like, I couldn't have done that before we left. So, yeah, got that taken care of, and now we're gonna go watch the Cheeseheads try to sneak out a W here against the Vikings! Three years. Really? What, does he yeah. like the dinner bell? Switching? I think the bike's probably faster. Now is the well, best time to switch to Verizon. Yep. Really? Grab the deuce. Grab the deuce. He's really small. Is he? Nah, yeah, leave it in. Leave it All in. Right. Oh my goodness. Wow, guys. The big frostbite dinner bell. Got the frostbite royal flush paired with the, the orange dinner bell here. And uh, he's not gonna quite be 15. Leftover pizza through that. Did you feel good? We didn't even watch it. On the heater. Oh, oh yeah. This is Nixon, who's dangerous. Uh oh. Uh oh! Crab it! Yes! No point. Crab it! Crab it! 105 yards. There we got an absolute behind whooping up there. Shaq's coming on. Darn it. It's my bad, boys. Watched it live. I know, so was I, but they never ever replayed it. Yeah. Premature? No, I don't even believe it. Oh, there he is on me. Whoa. Oh. A little bit better? Uh. Maybe. Hit the lights, Luke. Maybe. Luke, hit the light. No. 
Hey, that's still my biggest one here. It's a Lake of the Woods walleye. That's exactly. That is exactly. He actually come up pretty aggressive. Yeah, I like that. I thought he was coming to me. Yeah. Those things. Play. I'm still gonna be pumped. I don't. Right in there and punch that ball out. Deez. Give me a deuce. I got you. Deez. <coughs> Can't see fish of the shack. Don't be a Kit Kat. Don't be a kitty kitty kitty. If it's a walleye, it's a sow eating pig. It's an eye. Did I snag oh, you him? snagged him. Damn. Oh, nar. Damn. Oh, what an exhilarating. Felt like a sow. Uh -huh. 14 and a half. Uh -huh. 14 and a half. <laughs> Finally, biggest fish so far of the shack. Actually, it's not the catfish. You're up. Generator went out. Had to refill that up with gas, and now it's snowing bad. And uh, we got to get out of here at some point today. So fishing has been absolutely terrible. I think we've caught, left the tulips out overnight. This morning there was one four-inch walleye on there, so nothing crazy, but.